Today we're going to be reviewing set 10-0-7-8-1, Spider-Man's Techno Trike, which has 79 pieces, and let's get into it. As you can see, first there is the packaging, second, um, there is the back of the box, the side, one thing I noticed off the back is, I never saw this piece before, and when I was going home, I I looked at it and saw how, like, these looked like Mighty Micros, kind of, except Green Goblin looks way creepy on, like, oh no, oh, oh no, and then Mars Morales, well, they could have done dual molded legs, they did dual molded legs for, uh, Hulk, in this amazing, uh, Spidey and his amazing friend, uh, friends, yeah. Anyways, let's get into it. Let's get into it. I'm not scared, I'm not scared. Anyways, now to get back to it. Done with the glider. And here's the glider. Oh wait. I like that didn't happen. Oh shit, okay. Um let's just uh There we go. Rest in peace, Mia. Presenting Green Goblin and Miles Morales's. What, what does they call it again? So, ma'am. Oh, yes, that. Yeah, I totally knew that. Um, well, basically. Hey, why are you filming me? Show this. First up, we have Miles Morales, Spider-Man. And he is looking pretty, pretty cool. The one thing about him I don't like is the legs. So I know they could do dual molded. I think they could at least do dual molded uh, mid legs. Tell me if they can or not in the comments. I don't know. They might be able to do that in the future. You never know. Um. Anyways, but yeah, everything besides that is pretty decent. Gives me a uh, Mighty Michael vibes. So let's move on to the next minifig. Here is the green goblin. As you can see, I mean, he's a green goblin. There wasn't really much detail on the back. No arm pointing, pointing on the chest. He does have, he does have a different face, which on this angle it looks like he has a unibrow, um, but he doesn't. Uh, I'm going to take the piece off to show you what it looked like without it on. And as you can see, it just looks like a green guy, to be honest. Um, but yeah. Now let's... Oh, okay. Now let's move on to the accessories, which there really aren't much at all. Like, two. And this being uh, the Green Goblin's pumpkin bomb.
and here it is from a 360 view not much like at all but um yeah then this web piece that they've introduced i believe this was introduced forced heal in these uh sets so get this in uh red i, I don't know if miles Morales is supposed to be has uh like in the show but i sure know that he doesn't have a web uh a red web in the uh other the comics i've seen him in but I mean, maybe this is meant to represent his Venom Blast, but I doubt that. I really doubt that. Anyways, let's move on to the... Let's move on into the builds. First, let's start off with Spider-Man's Techno Strike. So this doesn't have much, to be honest. It just kind of... You know, it doesn't really do much. Um, you know, you could fit a minifigure in there. Um, this is a print, not a stickle, which is amazing for everyone, you know? The pain of putting stickers on and then realizing, oh, it's not supposed to be that way, you know? So, happy. Most people are probably happy about this. That's why most people like 40 plus sets, aka junior sets. But, uh, yeah. There, there really is nothing else to say, really, besides it's good. But I, 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 do, I don't like this gap. I just don't like this gap. It's like, what, what, if there's something should be healed. But, uh, besides that, really good. And then we have Green Goblin's Glidal, which, it's decent. I like that they used this piece, but I think they used it last time in 2019. Don't know if they used it in the 2020 Glidal, if he had one in 2020, or 2021. But either way, still decent. Gives me, I don't know, vibes. I was gonna say Maguire vibes, but it doesn't. It really doesn't. Could you imagine Maguire Spider Man just going on like a mint little tiny thing? It's like, ah, I've got you now, Spider Man. It's like, anyways. Now for my final reviews of the set. It's pretty good. It's like if you don't have a Green Goblin or a Maj Wallace Spider Man and you have ten bucks, then I'd say it's worth it. And if you like uh, oversized buildings and pointed pieces and not stickers those damn stickers. Uh, then, uh, yeah. Came to the right place. And if you want this, uh, piece, uh, I think it's a pumpkin. I know it's a pumpkin, right? Pumpkin, yeah. Um, it, yeah, it's, it's decent. So, uh, give it a 10 out of 10 besides the fact that the face and those legs look at those legs should be like just plain black or like if so if they're trying to do red then do like like just do like do molded also, this is the only uh, extra piece, so, you know, I was
was using this for like a thing to point out, but yeah. So yeah, 10 out of 10, bye.